Here we have Francine in her natural habitat, watching a lacrosse Yale game. <laughs> to Francine. Yoo-hoo! Nurse! <laughs> Long time no see, or, well, talk to for that matter. Francine, I've known you since all the way back during the first week of 8th grade when we met during lunch, and I was choking on water and you were laughing your ass off, <laughs> and we were crushing for the same jackass guy. Who knew four years later we'd still be going strong for the most part. While there were times when I felt like I was being a real jackass to you, I'll always miss and cherish the holidays and barbecues we'd spend with each other. You've introduced me and grew me closer to so many wonderful and amazing people who I've come to know and love. You've become like another part of my family to me, with your parents always making me feel like I was part of their family when they would be cooking dinner or even Zach being like the little brother I never had. I still remember the first day when we really hung out, when you were moving into your new house and we went swimming, only to go back to your house to grab something to eat and to go out to Kroger to, to get what was basically free ice cream for that day. <laughs> I'll miss the days that you, me, and Ella would run out and go shopping just so we could get away from your family for a bit, or when we would tie-dye clothes every time we hung out. Even the little events, eh, <laughs> even, even the little events like hanging out at your pool or going to Frankie's or even trying to get to the Freedom Expression Tunnel on NC State campus, <laughs> or even the time that that cookout employee roasted you for having McDonald's fries. <laughs> You've been one of my best friends I've had in my life, and while we don't talk much anymore, that doesn't affect the impact or meaning that our friendship has had. Ever, if you ever need something, or even if you just want to talk, please don't hesitate to reach out. I'll always try and make time to talk to you, and I'll try and do the same for you. <laughs> so, as one of my best friends, and one of the only, the one and only nurse in my life, <laughs> I love you, Francine, and I'm gonna miss you immensely. I love you, Francine. Hey guys, welcome to my 4th of July vlog. You're so tall! <laughs> welcome to my 4th of July vlog. We have Francine with us today, and Nelly, and Olivia, and Ella. Oh, hello! Uh, <laughs> so. Are you doing that? That? <laughs> I, I wasn't was... ready, I didn't know you were recording. <laughs> Me. <laughs> You know, I'm just really happy for Demi Lovato. Like, I like she's finding other lines of works. Like, like really great actress. Like, you're stupid. The amount of times that this woman right here has called me Connor, nurse, you need help. Uh, With a dream, I'm not again. again. Welcome to the land of fame and success. Where am I gonna fit in? Jumped in the cab, here I am for the first time I Looked to my right and I see the light <laughs> <laughs> so Sorry girl, we didn't mean to <laughs> Yo girl, what's up? Hey girl Bro, Hey, hey you, you, I don't I'm know your girlfriend, girlfriend. <laughs> oh my God, Guys, who the fuck is 207? And oh, what did he inspect? <laughs> Francine? You have some explaining to do Francine, what happened? <laughs> I think you dropped something. Kill yourself. Kill yourself. <laughs>
tell this woman to get my name right. <laughs> she's called me Connor. She's called me Thomas. She's called me Ben. I didn't call you Thomas. I, I said Ben. Can this make it better? <laughs> Stop. Hey Francine, yes. I think I hear your name. Let's hey Francine, yeah. I, I wish think you I hear <laughs> Francine, how you doing, girl? <laughs> <laughs> Are you recording? <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, she doesn't now. Hey guys. Oh my this god, is... so like a really good coming of age story. Like, stop! <laughs> I really relate to this. The snort. No problem. Anytime.